Hey guys, what's going on? Will Burkhead here on behalf of North Strand Audio. I'm here to do a side-by-side -side review of the Asininix bass or the Cat bass versions one and two. I'm gonna break down some of the major differences between the two basses, also the pros and cons, which actually aren't even pros and cons at all. They're actually apples and oranges. It's just what you like and what you prefer. So let's get to it. A lot of you guys that follow me have probably seen me playing this one for the past couple weeks. This one is the V1. This one actually has the pickup selectors and the EQ contours, two single coil pickups, one volume knob. It has the brush steel, I believe, for the bridge a proprietary bridge by Hipshot, and it has these lollipop tuners, if you can see those. This one is an awesome bass. I've been playing for the past couple weeks. I've taken this one to sessions, taken it to gigs, done my Easter Sunday service with this one in church, and I'll say that it's passed the test of everything that I've put it through. It definitely has its own voice. Mind you that it has its own EQ contours. Think of this bass as having 16 different presets, 16 different sounds that you can dial up at any time, and there you have it. Moving along to version two of the Ascendinix bass, as you can see, there's a few things that are different and I'll run those down in a second. What he has here is three single coil pickups, as you can see, instead of the two. And he's actually added a tone knob. It still has the pickup selectors. This top pickup corresponds to the first button. The second pickup corresponds to the second button. The third pickup corresponds to the third button. And it actually still has the series mode that the V1 has. If you smash down all four of these buttons, it'll act as one single pickup, all three of these, which gives you a really, really fat sound. Also, what I like about this is you can combine different pickup selections. So if you wanna add three and four, <laughs> you smash those down. If you wanna add one and two, you smash these down. And you can add the series mode to both of these configurations if you smash down the third button, which is actually a mute button on its own. If you smash all three, you get these two bottom running in series. If you smash one, two, and four, it runs a series mode with these two pickups right here. So let's try to do a side-by-side -side comparison. I'm gonna get some tones out of these and let me know what you think in the comments below. Thank you. 